guys, welcome back to the comic book lowdown. I'm Wellington, and uh, taking a break from all this homework I've been doing. Uh, gotta write a paper next, right after I do this video, and uh, it's just not looking f to be a great homework day. Been a good day, friends wise and stuff, but uh, hasn't been a great homework day and all that kind of stuff for me. And I had to stay after school for a couple hours. Well, no, I only stayed after school for a little while and I took a test. And uh, but then I had to go to another part of town and uh, pick up my uncle, and that ended up taking forever because uh, you know he wasn't ready. And then uh, then we got stuck in traffic and we had to stop by somewhere else. And then so I ended up getting home really late, uh, and then I had no internet till just a couple moments ago before doing this video before recording this video I should say and uh, I've just been a little annoyed but um, I did manage to get to the shop so that was a really good part of my day today and I picked up just three books I had on my pool this week um, I'm really excited about these books even though I don't sound it I'm kinda tired but um, uh, first book to show you guys this is Scarlet Spider issue number 15 which is a really cool cover even though I think I have to read the last issue again uh, it's been so long since one of these came out that uh, I, I forgot what's going on um, so I think I'm gonna have to read that last issue again I do remember not really liking where it ended off with Kane at the end but uh, uh, we'll see uh, I like I like when he's in his costume a lot better than what's going on now, where he's an actual spider, which looks kind of weird. Uh, I don't like that look for Kane. I want him back in the costume. Uh, next, I got Deadpool Illustrated issue number three. Uh, this is almost over. Next month this ends, and uh, that's a really cool cover with uh, the ghost of. Christmas past, I guess. Oh no, this is supposed to be the future, isn't it? I don't remember. I, I'm not good with the uh, ghosts, but uh, this is the ghost of Deadpool future, whatever. Uh, this this is a great book. I'm looking forward to reading this. Uh, and the cover is awesome. The art in this is better than in the uh, in kills the un kills them all the universe. I think so. Um, that gives another plus. And Bun did a really good job and really unexpected so far from what I thought. I didn't know how he's going to put in characters of literature into this story that he's telling. But uh, he definitely thought of a way of, you know, in integrating these characters. And uh, things are going to pick up a lot this issue, I, I can already tell. And the uh, final thing I got, which I'm really excited about, I heard great things from it already. Uh, and this is Batman Incorporated issue number nine, which I think is a, a cooler cover than uh, issue number eight. Yeah, this is this is this is a really cool cover. I would put this. I maybe would put this in another one of my favorite comic covers. Uh, it's just you know, those Venom covers beat beat almost everything out that I have because they're just awesome. But um, those are the books that I bought. Uh, I'm gonna get Thunderbolts. Uh, I'm gonna get Thunderbolts online just to see what it's like with this new take, new art, new, I guess storyline. I'm just gonna pick up the first issue. Probably won't pick up anything further than that, or not first issue, but this issue that came out this week. And I think I'm gonna be done after that. Um, and yeah, that's really it. Uh, I saw a preview to Savage Wolverine issue number six, and uh, there's going to be new art, and Zeb Wells is writing, so Frank Cho is not going to be on the book, so I think that the book might get better writing-wise. Uh, I would love if he stayed on art, because he, he's a great artist. I just don't think he had the character right, but um, I, I, I'm almost hoping that it doesn't pull out good just so I don't feel compelled to read 
uh, two Wolverine books, and you know they're both three ninety nine. I just want to stay on one, and uh, you know it, if if it's really good, it's gonna be a hard decision on whether to go Savage Wolverine or just Wolverine. So I'm almost pulling for it to not be great, <laughs> but that's in uh, that's in a couple issues. That's three more issues down the line. That's like three months, so I'm not too worried about that now. Um, but yeah, that's it for me. I'm Wellington signing off with the comic book lowdown. And I'll see you guys next time.